Hello, folks, and welcome back to Deus Ex, Mankind Divided. As always, of course, I am Falcon, your host, and we are doing the DLC. Uh, this happens to be the second DLC. We are most of the way through it, I think. Uh, we should definitely be able to finish it this episode. Um, Running diagnostics check. Entering seat heat sensor area. All right. Comes towards equipped with heat eye sensors, the latest and most cutting edge defensive technology to be used in the Palisade Blades. By scanning for changes in temperature, they're able to identify unauthorized, unauthorized personnel faster than any other defenses. Side by side tests, they'll identify intruders up to 0.7% times faster than a current top of the line video and motion detection sensors. Even if intruders become invisible through the use of an augmentation, they'd be detected anyway. Uh, we're working to improve it further and complete it, we'll be able to register microfractional changes in temperature and existing heat sources within range of the sensors. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Okay, well. Oh! Oh. And a robot. Well then. Okay. Well then. That's interesting. Get past that thing there. Uh oh. Did that one see me? No, but it could very easily see me if I am not positioned right. Um. Ammo do I have equipped on this right now? EMP ammo, okay. That's the type that I wanted, so I'm okay with it. Camera up there is fritzing the fuck out, because it can kind of see me, but not really. It can sort of kind of see me, but not well enough to actually be able to know that I'm there. Which means it's still obnoxious, regardless. Things are packing some really heavy firepower. This is where we might actually need to. Uh, I may actually need to go in here guns blazing because these things are not going to be easy for me to handle in any other way. Now, we just should have no actual people to contend with. It's only going to be robots and security systems from this point forward. So I actually don't mind going in guns blazing that much. That said. Uh, yeah, we might. Heat detection system in server chamber area is not registering normal temperature. Function. Have a whole lot of options here. Um, do we have armor piercing? We do. Okay, so we're gonna switch the armor piercing rounds on that. You're already set up with EMP. You're set up with that. You are basically useless because I don't have any ammo for you. But that's okay. Um, Alright, so. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Unauthorized. Okay. I didn't think, I didn't realize it could look below it and look behind it as well. I thought it was only for guarding the door. Well, I was wrong. It can look anywhere it feels like. I may, I, yeah, I very well, I think I'm just gonna, I think we're just gonna go in for broke here. I don't think we're gonna, I don't think I'm even gonna fuck around. We're just gonna go in straight up, all out for broke. Really do. I really do think we're just gonna go all out for broke here.
Fuck you. Not playing games with you guys. Not anymore. Not playing games with you guys anymore. I did expend a lot more uh, ammo than I would have liked, but... Oh well. I suppose. Okay, so this side is clearly the side that we want to be on. This will put us mostly behind the security sensors. Shit, 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 shit. No, they're not really looking at the door over here, so... Really not looking at the door too much, so we can kind of sneak past them. Without too much difficulty. Now, we did get detected there, which is bloody unfortunate, but it's kind of whatever. There wasn't a whole lot we could really do about it. Alright, so we've got security robots, we've got cameras, and other... Defenses, probably turrets as well. Where the hell are we trying to go? 204. There's 201. So we need to figure out where the hell 204 even is, and then we have to go get into it. I am going to go ahead and add in the ability to take over robots and turrets so that we can hopefully use the security things here to shut them down. So hopefully, holy crap, this one is insane. on it. Crap. Oh, we're gonna have to use the... Granted. Yeah, I had to use the thing. Alright, so we're gonna disable you, we're gonna shut down all of these cameras, we're gonna shut down all the turrets, so oh, turn that off. Although, unless there's security guards in here, we actually could... Honestly, unless there's security guards in here, we actually could break in and do whatever we wanted, really. But, whatever. Uh, this is the big security system controls and stuff, so we need to... Uh, Trace program initiated. All of these things are going to take forever. Let's just throw you in the clock because this is going to take a million damn years to get through all of this. All of these things without the overclock active. And we use a stopworm, which finds us just enough time to get into this guy. Alright, so is this separate cameras and stuff? And so it is indeed. Some separate things. So good, actually, that we turned this off, then. And that lets us open some more vaults. And I believe we should now have basically disabled all the security. So this should be a simple matter to do whatever the hell we want now. Because all of the security should be shut the hell down. Commencing diagnostics check. Or at least certainly the vast, vast, vast majority of it should be shut down. Anyway. Air purification system is operating at normal 
So I should be able to do whatever the hell I feel like doing. Oh. Interesting. So can we hack all of these different security places if we want to? Okay, just stay very close to the middle here. Make sure we're in the middle. Go to that, jump over there. Alright, wait for these to go back. readings in server chamber area are within acceptable parameters. Cooling systems functioning normally. Hikus fault. Oh, so can we not get anything from these? Do these not tell us in information or whatever? Bullshit. Bullshit, I say. I call a heavy degree of bullshit. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Yeah, we set off an alarm, but who gives a crap, really? Although, you know what? Fuck it. I will reload. Oh, crap. This is before I did that, though. Never mind. Never mind. I don't really want to deal with having to uh, hack through that computer again, so I'll just go with it as it is. Uh... Ooh. Yeah, don't say. Okay, interesting. Is there another way in? See, that's the one we were just in. The bottom floor there. So now we can look at... Okay, doesn't go anywhere. Let's go back over here, I guess. And then we'll go in... Let's see, so we went into that one. I don't even know, where the fuck am I? I'm like lost now. Okay, this is where I want to be. Alright, so. We went into A right there. So now we'll go into this one over here. And see if we find anything of interest. Uh, let's actually take the EMP generator. We can throw it into the one server station next one that we go into, and it'll shut down the uh, security in that place, or should anyway. Free multi-tool, I suppose I can take it. It's not necessarily the most useful thing in the world, but it's not necessarily the not useful either, so, you know. There's the door. What's in here? Oh, an active turret. Okay. Well. Look. Unauthorized heat signature detected. That didn't work quite as I had planned. Nah, yeah, it didn't quite work like I had intended, but. Oh well. I suppose. Now, I was hoping that you would be able to get 
like, things out of this, but apparently not. Just very disappointing. So there's no reason at all to go in there. So I guess I'm just gonna reload the quick save, because there's no reason to do that one. I'm gonna assume that there's no reason to do any of these, actually, because none of them seem to really be doing anything for me. So... Eh? Like, that place was pointless. This one's probably gonna be pointless too, but we'll, we'll check it out anyway. Oh, there's a camera in there. Alright. What does this one have as security? Electro... Zapping. Alright. So, is there like a means to disable the electricity? Possibly. Maybe not. seem to have any real point though, so uh, I'm not going to really, really worry about it. Alright, so we have a bunch of points that we can spend here if we so choose. I'm going to take the ability to pick up heavier things so we can actually pick up the turrets and stuff and we can move them around. Um, which should let me, like, shove these turrets over into a corner or something so they just will we'll shut the hell up and stop being a pain in my ass. Diagnostic sequence complete. Tarvos one. So is there any point to coming into here? There really doesn't seem to be any point to coming into any of these. Which is frankly kind of disappointing, but like I think you could have added a lot of flavor text and added a lot of like interesting things by making these other ones like side areas that you could like go in and explore and uh you know, if you broke into them, then you could get some extra information and stuff, but apparently, that's not a thing, it seems. Apparently, that's not something you bothered to do. Which is, frankly, pretty disappointing. Okay, so... We got There's the life one. Again, no reason to be in here though. It's two oh nine is over here. Gonna be able to, we're not going to be able to get into that one. I got the experience of going in there, so it's okay. It's like the experience is like the only real reason to go in there for. It seems. Yeah, that's the one we want, 204, so let's not do that one just yet. Because that's the one we're actually trying to do. It's the one we're required to do, so let's avoid that one for a moment. Is there... Almost looks like there's an alternative way into this place. We need the double super jump thing to be able to get up there, it looks like. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna bother. Thought maybe there was some point to going in there, but it doesn't really look like there is, so we're not going to waste our time. Sensors that don't move. Sent 
fruit. Is that what we're trying to get? I don't see why this is a thing, but whatever. Just give us alternative ways into it, I guess. Running diagnostics check in sector one, one. Okay. Okay, Pritchard. The passport's plugged into Santos' server. You getting anything? Hang on. I'm accessing the file. To... It's empty. I mean, the data was here, but it's been moved. Looks like to some kind of mainframe. Is Palisade stealing Santos' files? We need to find that mainframe. The data's being sent there through a private workstation. Saki yeah, that's a little serious. So now we have to break into the main plate, so the main area. guy. Find it, and you'll find the mainframe. It'll probably require a higher security clearance. Mm -hmm. I'll upgrade the passport while I'm linked to it. Just give me a second, then you can remove it. Okay, Jensen, I'm out. Yeah. Okay. So we now have the ability to break into the more advanced one, I guess. Cool. I don't know why we're bothering, but you know, whatever works. Well, voice recognition thing, all right. Well, we sure as hell ain't getting through there. Unless we can get something off this computer that will get us away in. Which we might. Who knows? Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access okay, granted. Whatever. Hacker report. Top 10 hackers were still at large. Shadow Child. Janus, of course. Uh, do, 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 do. Baba Yaga, who apparently works for them. Oh, that doesn't even talk about uh, what's his face. Our, our dude. Hacker group is slowly being dismantled. 43 of 58 hackers have been identified. Castle Freaks, the new group that's merged from the ashes. I assure you I have no connection to Baba Yaga 50. Except you totally do. You will pay. Oh, is this, uh, yeah, the, the husband, I guess, of the person who died. Okay, that did absolutely nothing for me. How the hell are we supposed to get into this thing? Voice recognition is ready. Oh yeah. That ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna work. Search for a sample of his voice. We already looked through all this, right? Yeah, so that doesn't do anything for me. So I don't know what the hell we're trying to do now. We have to find a sample of his voice, but like, where the hell are we supposed to do that? I don't fucking know. I don't know where we're supposed to find a sample of his voice. Unless that, this is where we now go into one of these other places, maybe. Maybe one of the other... Maybe one of the other vaults has access to something? I don't really know. I guess that's probably not what we want. 
I don't know what we would even be looking for for an app a sample of his voice. Like, I don't know where we could even expect to find something like that. Pretty sure I looked in all of these, and I never found anything that would really do that for me. supposed to be looking for at this stage. Sample of his voice. Yeah, I don't, I don't have any idea what we're supposed to be looking for. Which is the problem, because I don't know... I don't know, like, what we were supposed to be looking for? Yeah. Couldn't be this one, because those are maybe like, those are next to impossible to actually get over, unless you have the, um, unless you have that augment, and most of the time they don't make stuff that you would need a particular augment to do. Like, they just generally don't do that, so... I don't know what the hell we're supposed to be looking for, though, because I have not seen... I mean, there's this one. Guess we can enable this. I, mean, I don't know what the hell we'll go in here for otherwise. Does one even have a holotail? So that one didn't that didn't do anything for us. I don't know what the hell we're supposed to be looking for. It's the only one that we've been this is the only one that we've seen that did anything for us. And it didn't do anything for it didn't do that much for us. It didn't really help that much. I don't know what we're supposed to be looking for. Uh... No. Don't know. Somewhere in one of these little side areas, maybe. Maybe there's something. We just haven't seen. I don't. I don't know what the hell we're even supposed to be looking for. Like, how are we supposed to find a sample of his voice? How How are we supposed to accomplish such a thing? I have seen no I've seen no indication that there's anything anywhere that we can find that would do that for us. Like... 
unless like the security anomaly detected trace program initiated unless maybe it makes Unless maybe the security al Access alarm is like uses his voice or something. I don't I don't know what like how else we would find it. I don't get it. Really don't get it. Ah! Masaki Oshiro and his life's work now worthless. Dald knew everything. He even knew details about Saritakis' death. I think Stanton made a lucky guess and your reaction sealed it. It doesn't matter. We're on their radar now. That's what matters. Not some dead body. But they want complete access to everyone's files. We only look at client files when we make investments. Adding the people that Dalt represents to our insider trading scheme doesn't make it safe. Just think of what we will get in return from them. You're missing the point, Ashani. They'd have total access. Are you still recording? I swear, I don't understand why you insist on... Okay, so... Voice All recognition right. is ready. So we have to use the voice sample. Masaki Oshiro. Voice analysis in progress. Voice recognition confirmed. Welcome, Mr. Oshiro. Sweet. Pritchard, Oshiro and Talwar have been engaging in insider trading. That's why data's being moved. I think Simona Saradakis caught on to them. And they killed her to shut her up? The recording I found mentioned a Stanton Dowd who might also be involved. Get me connected to the mainframe. Maybe I can find out more when I'm inside. Oh good, there's a thing here, so we are not at we are not at the end, actually. Wow. That's Richard. A lot of shit. What's it looking like on your end? We were right. Santos files are here. I'm gonna extract what I need. Richard? Tash trapped, Jensen. I can't get to the exit. Shadow Child, she may be... Foreign virus detected. Destroy my source. Oh, shit. Shadow Child, I've got a situation. I lost contact with Nuclear Snake and the NSN, and the Blade security system fried the passport. What? That... That's bad. Very, very bad. Without the passport signal, our friend's avatar has no way out of the NSN. They'll be able to use its signature to pinpoint his location. Is there something I can do? There's an NSN chair here connected to the mainframe. Really? I might be able to open a gateway for him if I hack into the Palisades network using your infolink frequency. You can do that? I might be the only hacker in history who can, but now is not the time for bragging. Just sit in the chair and I'll do the rest. Oh, good. Oh, see, now we have stuff we have to do in here then, so this is not near the end. This is not the end. I thought it was. So you have like a breach thing to run now. Shadow Child, I'm in. I don't have eyes on Nuclear Snake's avatar. This is incredible. Mr. Jensen, the Palisades mainframe is unlike any NSN server I've seen before. It's... sorry. Okay. From what I can tell, you're in a partition of the mainframe server. I see traces of two avatars in the code. The other one must be our friend. Probably. Clearly, some sort of teleport or something, because there's no other way to go about doing anything here. Oh, shit's like moving around and doing weird shit. That's kind of freaky. I hope this area is not that long. I despite see you, Shadow Child. 
His avatar is out of reach. It doesn't seem like I can communicate with him. That's because the Palisade's virtual defense systems are interfering with his connections. If you extract the program from the data towers in this server, it should disable the system's hold on him. Sounds easy enough. I took the liberty of applying a few augments to your avatar that may come in handy. In the meantime, I'll work on opening a gateway for him to use as an exit point. That's weird. We're like having... Uh, well, what the fuck? Aha! You don't say. Yeah, so this is just an endless loop. So we have to walk across here. Do that. The mainframe's defense system is the toughest I've ever encountered. The AI core is adapting and fighting back every attempt I make to open the gateway. You got it. I'm still working on extracting the data from these towers. Sure, we don't have something else that we need to do here. Oh, what's his face is up above us. Okay, I'm pretty sure there's gonna be something else we have to do though, because I can't imagine that's just gonna be that simple. Or maybe it is. Okay. What the hell did that do? elsewhere in the AI looks away from the mainframe. Smart. I should warn you. Nuclear Snake will not be happy about it. He doesn't get a vote. Do it. Okay. Okay, so I don't know where this thing is going to go or what it's going to do, but... Nuclear Snake may not be happy about it, but frankly, it's his problem, to be perfectly honest with you. Okay. Nope. Close enough. Not quite what I was aiming for, but more or less got the job done, I suppose, so. Really? Digital vent? That's kind of weird. Oh, what the fuck. back where we were. Okay. Well, that's good, at least. That's good, at least. I don't just die or whatever. This uh, DLC is longer than the first one was, though, by quite a bit. Apparently. Dumbass, climb through the lane. <laughs> Going to make a save once we get a reasonable distance here. Like, probably when we get to here. There we go. through until we can get on top. And we gotta drop down onto the platform there when we're halfway across. 
I'm guessing. But fairly easy to do, we just have to figure out how to do it. So what the hell just happened? It is. Yeah, it's me. Well, this look is an improvement, that's for sure. Uh -huh. If it isn't obvious by now, our covert mission is screwed. Every yeah. river in the world is probably attacking the Blade servers as we speak. Time and options were not on our side. Did you find what we were looking for? Hopefully. I'll know after I start analyzing the files back in the real world. Good? Let's discuss I guess. And how precisely do we get out of here? Does this take Shadow us out? Child. Oh, Nuclear snake so is it out. does. Shadow child. Oh, that's good. Damn it! Being jammed. That probably means that we're about to have what. Oh, I'm not out. Uh Okay. Wait, wait for something to be different. Uh, I don't fucking know. Don't think the dude's out, despite your conviction that he is. Like, we weren't out. We were still stuck in the system, so I would not be at all surprised if he's still stuck in there somehow, too. Because the system was able to trick us into thinking that we were out, even though we really weren't. And we're still going to have to find a way out of the entire building, too. Although that should be pretty simple. If this loading screen ever finishes. There you are, Mr. Jensen. I lost connection with you for a moment. Are you out of the NSN yet? Yes, and so are now. Good. I've been working on an escape option for you. There is a maintenance hatch on the underside of the blade. It's a quick exit, but also a long drop to the river. It's that or I leave the way I came in. Fight or fall, I guess. Exactly. Get to your apartment. There are things we need to discuss. Shadow Child, you and I also need to talk. Privately. Okay, Nukes. The mainframe door is open, Mr. Jensen. I'll keep working on getting that exterior hatch unlocked. Thanks. Now, oh. Shadow Child. Well then, um... Okay. Let's... Let's do this the easy way, actually. Uh, there is an easy solution to this. And we're probably going to use that easy solution. Because I'm sure the easy solution is going to be the much simpler way to go about solving this problem. The exterior hatch is unlocked. Buona fortuna, Mr. Jensen. 
I appreciate well, your is help. the exterior How are you still connected to the blade systems? Just be thankful that I am. And get out while you still can, my friend. know if the, ro if the de security defenses, the built-in ones, are going to be able to deal with the robots or not, but it should be able to. Because there's a lot more of them than there is of the uh, robots, so that should handle the robots for us. So now the question is, where the hell am I going? Oh, apparently there's a way out back in the other room here. Well, I think I can go feel free to use up my ammo that we have, because we have no need to really do anything else with it at this point. Fuck you, security. And Geronimo! Oh, hi. again, Mr. Jensen. I see you actually came to my place. How the you hell did you find me? Into my place, I let myself into yours. Yeah, Here enough. you can tell a lot about a person and by how clean they keep their home when they are not expecting visitors. I wonder what the police will think of mine. You're sure they traced you then? It's only a matter of time. What we accomplished tonight, punching through the Palisades defenses, the breach is going to help us expose everyone's dirty little secrets. The breach? You mean you didn't close the hole you made? Why would I? Besides, it's not possible. Word of what we did is spreading through the dark net like wildfire. Rippers will be attacking the Palisade servers day and night to get at the truth. This, this is like a good leads thing, you right Mr. into Jensen. the breach game it's mode that's available. Eh. Yeah. Find out what's really going on inside the bank, and in the end, we barely scratch the surface. I look forward to seeing what the others find. So, attacking their personal accounts of innocent individuals, invading privacy, what does that leave us? That's what you wanted. This was a covert mission that was supposed to have a small footprint. You've jeopardized all of it. Yeah, I'm gonna support I wanted to find out what's really going on inside the bank, and in the end, we barely scratched the surface. I look forward to seeing what others will find out. This will change things. At this you very minute, that, but... thousands of rippers are accessing data in small amounts. It's a tiny crack in a dam, but it can grow and maybe even bring the Palisade Bank Corporation and its founders down. Let's hope so. Tell me something. Now that you don't have an apartment anymore, what's next? My partner and I are debating. We're either moving to California wine country or Argentina. No. One thing is for sure, though. Shadow Child's time in Europe is over. And now I must go. Nuclear Snake is very upset about the breach. I think I will be mending fences with him for a long time. How do you tell someone like that that they need therapy? You don't. You don't. Ciao, Mr. Jensen. Yeah. Don't get yourself arrested, shot, Ciao. and or killed. Just saying. All right. Richard, what the well, hell do you want like now? Well, looks like you and I made it out cleanly, Jensen. The authorities haven't identified us. Shadow Child might not be so lucky. She's leaving town. Between you and me, I think she wanted things to trace back to her. There were other options. This was supposed to be a small investigation into Santo. Instead, thanks to her, we're responsible for the Woodstock of hacking. She helped get <laughs> you out. Regardless, are you forgetting what we found out in there? That Oshiro and Talwar have been accessing their clients' confidential files and illegally making millions based on insider information? Talk about privacy infringement. It's worse than that, Pritchard. The recording I heard mentioned Saradakis' death. 
I think she found out what they were doing and they killed her for it. Did you find anything on Stanton Dowd? Only that there isn't much to go on. From what I can see, he's just an old money trillionaire who's more skilled at breaking even than he is at making a profit. Oshiro mm -hmm. seemed concerned about the people Dowd represents. There has to be more. If you want me to, I'll keep digging, but I suspect it will be a waste of time. In the meantime, your hunch about Saridakis may be right. But again, we don't exactly have solid evidence. The insider trading scheme is an interesting lead for someone to pursue, but it's complicated. Mm, fair because enough. we got the lead by breaking in and essentially committing the same crime. Exactly. So what do you want me to do? <sighs> Come back to bite us. No, I think we release it. Let's release what we have on the dark net. The world needs to know that the Palisade Bank is a sham. Maybe the investigation will take on a life of its own. Once rippers like Shadow Child get a hold of it, it probably will. That may be Simona Sardakis' best chance for justice. Probably. It's our only chance, really. So. What about you and your client? Did you find anything incriminating in Santos' files? I'm still analyzing them. So far, their plans for Rabia look legitimate. It's because they are. The timetable seems very aggressive, though. It has to be. If the Human Restoration Act passes, a lot of augmented people have no choice but to move there. Yeah. That could be good or bad, depending. I just... I hope it doesn't come to that, Jensen. For any of us. Well, we did stop we it from it. coming to that, so, well, you know. Well, as enjoyable as this little escapade of yours has been, I need to... To get uh, back to that moody loner thing you do so well. <laughs> I understand completely. Besides... I have a report to file with my client. You know, Jensen, this may be the last time we ever work together. Assuming, of course, you don't get yourself half killed, saving the world again, and call on me to Goodbye, get Francis. Take care of yourself. They're kind of friends, they're kind of really not, too. It's, it's, I don't know, but... Alright, so... The end of the second DLC. Again, we are not going to watch the, uh... We're not going to watch this because I don't have time to watch that. Uh, but... Yes. Uh, so that did kind of detail where the breach... Uh, system rift, that's what it's fucking called. Um, so it does kind of detail what the Breach game mode is and where it comes from. Um, which I didn't know before. It's funny, that's actually her... her place. Um, so... Yeah. Uh, I will... there should be more DLC coming out for this eventually. I will probably try and do it at some point. But I've said that about some DLC for us some other games before and never gotten around to it. At least not yet. So, I don't know. I'll probably play it myself, but rather I'll actually record it or not. Who knows? Uh, regardless, though, this has been Deus Ex Mankind Divided, and more specifically, the Jensen Stories little DLC that they had. Uh, System Rift in particular for this and the last episode. Thank you for watching, folks, and I will see you uh, in the next game. So, take it easy, have a good day, bye-bye. Oh, uh, please do remember to like and subscribe because it does help me out a great deal. Take it easy, folks.